<laughs> ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? You've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who are getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. Hey, wait up! Together. Marston, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East, the result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was you. I'm just changing the facts. He's no more a scientist than I am a priest. But people can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, that West Dickens. I can't understand a goddamn word he said. A more flannel-mouthed bunko artist I've never met. Look at them vultures circling up ahead. We should check it out. Marston, Eli, go see what it is. Man, this don't look too good. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. Still smoking. The well, scumbags must still be around. Come on. Yeah. Let's pound leather, boys. Looks like they're headed for Ridgewood Farm. Sons of bitches. If you want to run a gang of outlaws, Marston. Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing and thieving's never right, boy. No matter how you dress it up. Place looks deserted. Where is everyone? Split up and search the area. John, you check the buildings in the barn. Shed's clear, Marshal. Go. Right. 
right. No one would board up a barn like this. Break that door down. The rest of you, get your guns ready. Holy sweet mother of mercy. Please, please don't shoot me. Some bandits came by and took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> Clear. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Thank you. I was convinced I was dead. I've seen something. As soon as you can, make a run for the shed. And keep your head down. Thank you. They said they were gonna kill us all. Look like that's all of them. Let's see how the hostages are doing. of that bunch gets fifty dollars it ain't about the money marshal these are people's lives people's homes 
Mount up, boy. We gotta get after those bandits. Follow me. We can still catch them. Let's go. What's your major weight in anyway, Martin? Let's just say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell are you talking about? Some people I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. He was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. And bear in mind, he's left me for dead the last two times I've seen him. I'm about bigger and we've moved past the family part. Somebody on the cliff? You just walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Everybody, take cover! In that shed! Keep together and stay in here. This is the best cover we got. That ain't nice! Bitch, he's still breathing. <laughs> Come here, boy. <laughs> Come on, Bessie. Give. <laughs> oh. Norman Deke. <laughs> Fuck. Nice to see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is going to help us get to Bill. <coughs> Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Deke. Mighty kind. Fuck you. Hog time. Let's get him to jail. 